Hey everybody, Santa back again. Saturday, November 25. We got a beautiful morning here. It's about, uh, I don't know, 9, 9.30. I forgot to look. And it's a beautiful sunny day. With a nice little breeze. Uh, there are some motorcycles coming in for the weekend. Let's take a look. This flag's all caught up again. Well, there's there's a, like a, a bolt sticking out of the pole that keeps catching on that. I don't know where the bolt came from. This one's all right. But there are quite a few people here on the beach. Well, not a lot. There's a few people. There's a bunch of people over there by Carino's. Playing on the rocks. Let me see if I can show you. There you go. But a real nice Saturday here. Nice day for if I had a nice uh, big, big bike, motorcycle, I'd take a ride. Oh, here's a bunch of people over here. I don't know what they're doing. They were doing a little dance. All wearing white. I don't know, maybe it's a birthday or religious thing don't know they were just uh, dancing I missed that come over this way anyway I'm sitting down here by the beach on the cement table uh, cooking chicken again for lunch Grace just left for uh, Ibuna with the kids because uh, on December 1st, Catherine has to dress up. They're all dressing up as Disney characters for school for some reason. I don't know why. Their favorite character. So she had an old uh, outfit from a long time ago, but it has to be uh, mended repaired uh, and she grew a little obviously so they're gonna fix it so she can wear that so we don't have to buy another one since it's only for one day uh, so that's where they went while I'm cooking but uh, other than that not a whole lot going on It's gorgeous out here though. Beautiful, beautiful. As I said before, this is the time to come, people. If you uh, are thinking about coming to the Philippines, you know, Christmas, around Christmas time is the best. November through February, four months are really good. Although there are still uh, issues about typhoons. But uh, right now I checked the weather and there's nothing around. There's some kind of low pressure system out in the Pacific keeping them away, which is good. So there's nothing forming out there right now. So this is just perfect, perfect time. You have to enjoy it while it's here because uh, you only get like four months of really good, good, nice weather. Then once it starts getting hot, it gets hot. Kind of gets miserable if there's no breeze. And then uh, another part of the year is just raining, raining a lot. So uh, enjoy, enjoy the good weather. But really, here in the Philippines, it's only uh, it's only two seasons really. 
you know, you got your nicer weather like this and then you got your totally crazy hot. For me, it's never cold. Some Filipinos, yes, they get cold. They wear jackets. Uh, when you're on a motorcycle, you kind of want a jacket just to be safe. And then you want to take some rain gear with you. That's what most people do, especially if they're taking a long ride. Because you never know when it's going to rain, you're going to hit a shower. So it's always good to be uh, prepared. But really, uh, not much else is happening. We want to repair our right of way. A lot of the fence posts are really rotten. So we're trying to figure out a good way to do it where we don't have to keep doing it often. Because if you use uh, wood, especially the crappy wood, it just rots. Most people use these cement posts, but they're a little more expensive. So that's another thing Grace wants to do. She wants to go with the hardware and check the prices. Because some, some places make these already made cement posts. And you just put them in the ground. And you just put the wire around them. They sell them already made like that. So I'm going to see how much they are. Because we need quite a few posts. As you guys have seen, I right away, we have a lot. A lot of posts. There's probably at least 30, 40 maybe even more I didn't count them and you know you talk about 100 pesos each if they're 100 they might be 200 each it's a lot of money adds up and then labor on top of that you gotta pay somebody to dig up of course our uh, caretaker I'll do some of it he already gets paid I might give him a little extra and then he needs a helper so it's just more money plus I want to uh, do, redo the gate out front there it's just cheap bamboo I'd like to do a nice uh, like metal gate that's gonna last like our metal gate here so I might do that uh, beam is always looking for work he's gonna have to do some welding now but uh, he's always looking for something to do so we'll see he already owes me some money so that might be a good thing to do Plastic blowing on the beach. Always from these resorts that don't clean up, people just throw their trash and then their trash blows over here. Can't stand that man. Blows over from the the camping one over here. Uh, mommy's just got home. So I'm going to go see what she found out. Maybe I'll do another video later. But uh, for now, I'm going to sign off because I want to see what she came up with. I'm surprised she's home this quick. So stay tuned, everybody. Maybe I'll do another video later. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. It is free. And God bless everyone. Santa Claus. Over and out.